What's up guys, this is iTweaks here with iPhoneHacks.com and if you guys haven't heard, there's a new iMessage bug out and if you haven't seen my previous videos on this, then you definitely need to check them out. But if you're on a jailbroken device, this is actually going to uh, completely prevent that messages bug from happening. So you can see right here, if I go ahead and open up my messages app and then I paste in this message, you'll notice once I send this, that it's actually going to reboot my device or crash my springboard. So that's the bug in a nutshell. Now once we come back, I'm gonna go ahead and show you that after installing this tweak, that you won't fall victim to this bug anymore. All right, so now we're back after my springboard crashed and I've actually already fixed the issue with the messages app, as you can see right there, I can open that up. So now what you wanna do is just go over into Cydia and then you're gonna to wanna to add a source. That source is cydia.angelxwind.net. Now I'll put that on the screen right here. I'll also put it in the link in the description below for you guys to just copy and paste. But then what you wanna do is search for this tweak right here called ineffective power. Now, once you see that, all you wanna do is install it, confirm, it's very small, and it should respring your device. And then once it respring's, I'll go ahead and prove to you guys that it works by sending that message to myself and my phone is not going to crash. All right, so now we're back. So if I go ahead and open up my messages and we open up this conversation, let's go ahead and paste this in just to show you guys that nothing is going to happen. So I'll even get a banner notification right up here and it always respring's before you get the banner notification. So just to show you guys, in case you're a little skeptical that I didn't use the original text, we'll go ahead and paste that one in. And you can see I'll get the banner notification right up there at the top and I have no issue whatsoever with this problem anymore. So if you're jailbroken, definitely download that tweak by adding that repo. And if you're not jailbroken, then you can always use this Siri method. So let me know what you guys think about this process in the comments below. Of course, if you're still having issues, be sure to let me know in the comments and I'll try to help you guys out. All right, guys, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you smash that like button. If you guys wanna see more of my videos, then go ahead and subscribe. All right, until next time, peace.